Here we are playing gang Zelkova serrata, one of my very favorite trees because of its toughness and its durability. Uh, but as I stand here by the bark, I notice the beautiful honeycomb character of its bark, how beautiful this plant is. Uh, it has been used as a replacement for the American elm uh, because of its shape. It tends to have, in particular in youth, a vase shape uh, that is great for a street tree. There's even cultivars, one in particular called green vase, that is known for its upright habit. So this is a great tree to consider for the home landscape, for a street tree. It's tough, it's durable, uh, but it also has other great characteristics, beautiful fall color, fine texture. It's one that you should really consider. Here we have the leaves of Zelkova serrata. You can see that they're alternately arranged on the stem. Very plump, kind of rounded buds are distinctive, but also the serrations on the edges of the leaf are quite distinctive as well. They're almost like saw blades tilting towards the tip of the leaf. Again, Zelkova serrata, the Japanese Zelkova. This is a deciduous tree. It's native to Eastern Asia. It's hardy from zones five through eight. It can get 50 to 80 foot high and spread out 50 to 80 foot wide. Uh, it does have very nice fall color, uh, but trees tend to be a little bit variable. I've seen trees that are fully yellow in fall color, and I've seen trees that are almost uh, burgundy red in fall color, and then variations in between. Uh, a vase-like habit, upward sweeping branches, uh, in particular in youth, slightly opening up with age, loves full sun, uh, medium water requirements, uh, which makes it adaptable as a street tree in a lot of cases. Here is a landscape tip. May be used as a lawn, shade, or street tree. Beautiful texture in leaf and bark.